Hi there. I'd like to talk a little bit about testosterone. You see so much about testosterone today, it seems that it's almost on every other ad on TV. Whether it's for the good part of testosterone, that is the gels or the creams that are out there selling billions of dollars of product, or whether it's from the lawyers on the other side chasing after the, per the perceived problems with testosterone. Well, the fact of the matter is, is that low testosterone is a big problem for men and for women. Low testosterone is a problem that comes about naturally with aging. In men, our testosterone peaks at around somewhere between age 25 and 28. And from there, it's a relentless decline over the next 25 years, to the point where as much as 90 to 95% of the testosterone produced is no longer made by a man. This can lead to very serious problems. It can lead to heart disease, it can lead to prostate cancer, it can lead to certain other cancers, it can lead to Alzheimer's disease, osteoporosis, and yes, it does lead to sexual dysfunction and erectile dysfunction. The things that commonly are believed to be the only things that testosterone is good for. Well, testosterone is an essential hormone. It was put there naturally to be useful. Obviously, men need to be strong and fit. Testosterone is very important for muscle tone and balance. That's why when older men and older women try to go to the gym, they don't see any effects when they work out. One of the reasons is testosterone is out of balance or too low. So testosterone is very good for muscle building, muscle balance, and muscle strength. It's also essential to maintain clear thinking. A lot of times men who are low in testosterone will come in and say, hey doc, you know, I just can't keep up anymore. I feel like I'm, the young guys are a step ahead of me. What do I do? Well, that's a surefire sign that you may be suffering from low T. Another one that I love and is really kind of funny, I've had men come into the office and say, hey doc, you know, when I walk by the couch, I hear it calling my name. Do you feel like that? Do you think that the couch is just looking for you to lie down on it, to exercise those springs in that cotton? Doesn't it sound wonderful? Maybe it sounds good, that's where you want to go right now. Well, if it's two o'clock in the afternoon and you feel like you need to find the couch, you're probably low in testosterone and you need to be checked. So testosterone is an essential hormone. It's not just for sex. It's for health, longevity, and wellness from cancer to heart disease to osteoporosis to Alzheimer's disease. If you feel like you're low in testosterone, give my office a call and set up a consultation and I'd love to discuss it with you.